Welcome back, family. Grand Rising. I hope everyone is doing wonderful today. Today is January 24th, 2023. That equals up to five. The energy of today is number five. Five means balance, movement, energy, and of course, change. <laughs> this could mean personally, personal growth, career success, uh, career changes, or even major events in your life that's changing. I'm so happy. I was just thinking, um, almighty, that I don't look like what I actually go through. <laughs> I am so very thankful that I do not look like what I go through, you know? And again, I have the strength, maybe not every day, like I'd like to sometimes, but um, I get to, like I said, talk to you guys and it, that makes me happy. So, like I said, I'm also going through some things and it's just like, I wanna, I wanna pull my hair out, but I can't do that. So, I know that I am a shining light to someone out there, so I can't give up. So, you're looking at me and I have to show you the way and the steps and the reasoning of why you should not give up, right? So, like I said, number five means change and the courage to change all things. And if you have the courage to change, then just believe that all of your dreams and your desires will come true. Personal development, that's the topic for today. And personal development in itself has many and many of topics. One of just uh, um, what we will be discussing on today will be spirituality. Okay, so uh, like I said, there are many topics um, under personal development, such as time management, adaptability, Goal setting, self-awareness, self-confidence, problem solving, um, mental health, meditation, um, self-management, stress management, <laughs> uh, med meditation, social skills, and the list goes on. <laughs> so um, personal development, this subject is going to, I'm going to drag it on through February, which is Black History Month which um, I have a few free giveaways um, to give to five special people out there. <laughs> so, but we'll talk about that at the end of the video. But today's topic is on um, personal development. Personal development in, any, in many ways um, is detached or connected to healing, right? Personal development is looking inward and focusing on ways to better yourself. It refers to like activities that are designed to improving your talents and your potential. Anytime you are consciously thinking about and making the effort to input, uh, betterment into your self and things around you, you are participating in personal development. Okay. Spirituality, on another hand, enhances your ability to deal with life's ups and downs. So if you were like following me, like I said, if you were following me, if you have been following me, you know that spirituality gives you a sense of uh, peace and hope. And um, it teaches you accountability. It definitely does that. But, like, it, it helps you understand and know that there's uh, something better, you know, in its place. So, 
spirituality enhances the ability to cope with or manage um, your ups and downs. There are many ways that spirituality can support your mental health as well. You, Like I said, you may feel a sense of peace, hope, a strong sense of connecting to your higher self or a higher sense in purpose. Spirituality, personal development, and or personal growth is all about new ways of healing your body from inward to outward. Healing one's lifestyle and your emotions. It becomes, like I said, it becomes very uh, or much easier to uh, manage and cope with your, your day-to-day life. Your strong desires to grow and um, in growth will continue in different phases. You know, growth is like different phases. Getting yourself aligned um, or in continuing development and developing yourself on a day-to-day basis helps you see that you are a part of a higher purpose. Developing more and more Um, knowledge every day that you're on your life's purpose. The main purpose for spirituality is seeking and meet a meaningful connection with something bigger and something more powerful than oneself, right? And um, in life, it contributes to an overall increase in, um, in your life and the satisfaction of it becoming Um, In most cases, you become happier, pleased, and you become willing to do the work on yourself and to just help others, you know, grow as well where you have or um, because, you know, healing is not one day. It's a continuance um, journey, but you get better and better at, um, let's say, using your throat chakra, being able to speak up for yourself, you know. What you didn't say no to, you're able to say no to now, you know, and that's you're you're becoming stronger and more confident and more aware of, you know, your thoughts, your feelings and your emotions, you know, and how to respond. So there are five benefits of spirituality as well. And like I said this morning, you have to give gratitude to each and everything that you have. No matter um, what the next person is doing, no matter what the person, the next person has accomplished, what have you accomplished? So, and what are you thankful for? So show gratitude, you know, each and every day. Like my meditation is I walk around and I talk to myself. I don't care. (laughs) Uh, I talk to myself. I don't give a Okay. So, hey, uh, your meditation may be um, in a small, uh, you know, room or your bedroom, your closet, however you want to, you know, do it. And you may um, sit peacefully in your stance, you know, however you meditate, you know, but just show gratitude, okay? Um, You become more um, compassion, compassionate. You show more compassion. That's what I wanted to say. (laughs) You improve your social skills and your connections, right? You become better at coping and managing with stress, anxiety, and depression. And I'm going to tell you that, yes. You um, do more of developing and growing positive relationships as well. You know, so that's very important in one's life, right? We we need to um, have positive relationships around us because... Baby. (laughs) Spirituality is not for people that lack courage to face difficult situations or difficulty in their emotions in facing yourself as well as other people. Spirituality is not for the weak. And you will know that as you... um, Face, like I said, your day-to-day obstacles, your challenges. Once you become better and um, you see better, you know better, you do better, there are challenges as well on that stage. <laughs> like the rich, like they say, the rich, um, more money, more problems. Okay. 
<laughs> and that's what it is. So it's just like that. So um, you have to.